Good morning students. Today we will do the question answer of the prose The Best Christmas Present in the World by Michael Mapugo. Working with the text, page number 16. First question. For how long do you think Connie had kept Jim's letter? Give reasons for your answer. Connie had kept Jim's letter for a long time. She had received it on January 25, 1915. Jim had written it on December 26, 1914. At that time, Jim was an officer, a captain in the English army. A captain in the army is always a young man. It means that Jim's wife Connie must have also been young. In the story, she is 101, that means 101 years old. It means Connie had kept it for a long time. There are hints also. The table containing the letter was found in a junk shop. Again, it indicates its oldness. Second question. Why do you think? The desk had been sold and when? The desk must have been sold when Connie's house had burned because the table had been damaged by fire as well as water. Why do Jim and Hans think that games or sports are good ways of resolving conflicts? Do you agree? Both Jim and Hans Ulf were soldiers. They had been a witness to all the sufferings of war, so it is natural for them to hate war. However, the problems between two nations are bound to be there. A non-violent method to resolve these problems is what they desire. So, they think that games or sports are good ways of resolving conflicts because nobody dies in matches. No children are orphaned and no wives become widows. I also quite agree with them. Question number 4. Do you think the soldiers of the two armies are like each other or different from each other? Find evidence from the story to support your answer. The soldiers of the two armies are like each other. The story is all about it. Below are some instances to prove. Both the armies celebrated Christmas by sharing food and spending time together in smoking, laughing, talking, drinking and eating. They liked to greet each other. They played football and, and agreed that the problems may be resolved by playing games or, instead of fighting wars. The soldiers of both the armies agreed about the negative aspects of war and longed for peace. They hoped to unite with their families again. Thus, there is much which is common between them. Today we will do up to this. Next day in the next video, the rest of the answers will be provided. Till then, note it down in your notebook and learn it. Thank you. Have a nice day.